What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are playing some more Dead Rising. So, um... <laughs> I don't know. Just gonna continue where we left off. I... I, I just really want to play some Dead Rising. Oh, shit, yeah. Let's get there. Oh, yeah, uh, I believe we left off. We killed, uh, the convicts again. So, now we're kind of just... Waiting for this next mission. Also, in case y'all are wondering, Howie, um, why the episodes of Dead Rising are so long instead of like 30 minutes or something? Like 30 minutes through an hour where I keep it at like an hour, like minimum or something? The reason why is because I'm I'm just simply enjoying myself. I hope y'all understand that, like, oh my god. Die. Like, I'm enjoying myself. And I feel like I'm having more fun with the length that I play. And I've only been playing this game on recording. I haven't, like, played off camera. I mean, I have in the past. But I meant, like, ever since I started playing this again, I've only been playing it on camera. Also, that little lag thing there... Apparently, I looked it up, and this is a common thing, and I don't know why it does that, but apparently it was like a poorly executed like thing where if you use a heavier weapon, it makes it kind of like have an effect, like a thump effect, but it just does not work well. That's what I've seen off of a Reddit thing. But, um... But yeah, when you see that lag, I thought it was because there was too much going on. But I I was wrong. That's why I would like the katana and everything. It doesn't really do that. Owie. We need to get to where we need to go. What's in this box? Wonderful. Alrighty. Also, we got a key, uh, key from Cliff. Which, I don't know where we use the key. But we do go in here. Close the door. And, um... Oh, yeah, we just gotta wait in here. Case 5-1, a promise to Isabella. Start at 12 a.m. Empty area, North Plaza. So, it's nearing 12. I believe every 7 seconds, there's a tick that goes by. So, in about a minute, or maybe a little bit under a minute, we should be ready. So, I'm just gonna, like, talk to you guys for a few while we wait patiently. How are y'all today? It's pretty good. Yeah, I'm horrible at making conversations. <laughs> just excited to get on with this game. I really am. Uh, today, it's Saturday at the... Well, it's technically Sunday, but it's like... It's like 2 in the morning. I went to my dad's ceremony, and that went pretty well. Surprisingly. I, I, I wasn't looking forward to it too much, because, you know, like... When you, love, when you have a loved one that passes away and there's a ceremony for him, it, it can hurt. It does. That's just how it is sometimes, but... It went fairly well. Now the last thing that I'm dreading is uh, my upcoming surgery <laughs> in September. Come on. Okay. We literally have a katana. <laughs> I can't hit it! 
I don't know why it wasn't aiming on him, and I don't know why I had wine equipped. No, it was Carlito. I tried to talk him into coming, but it was no good. He, he doesn't trust anyone. He shot you? He didn't mean to. He was upset. I don't know what he'll do next. Hey. Hey. Damn. God damn Carlito, man. Like, there's things about him that come off as good, but he just makes some asshole decisions. And I know why he's doing it. It's just... It's not the way to go about. I'm so sorry. I never meant to shoot. Holy shit, he's actually hey, talking. Carlito, you shouldn't have shot her in the first place, guy. That was your fault. You're not right. You shot your sister. Too bad! When you shoot someone that literally is there for you because you don't trust anyone, even if it was accidental, that's going to put a dent in your relationship with that person. That's on you, guy. I'm also very glad that that fucking Gone Guru music isn't playing anymore. That means we took care of the convicts permanently and we no longer have to worry about them. I don't know why they came back again, though. They were here twice. I killed them once and the exact same convicts came back again twice. Hopefully it stays at twice. I'm hoping. So, if I'm correct, we have to take her to the safe house. Oh, you bitch. Also, this music in the background that's playing in this little transporting mission. Oh my goodness gracious, bro. Ah! Jesus Christ, dude. Isabella, come on. Let's get out of here. There's too many. <laughs> So many zombies. Too many zombies to handle, man. All of them on my fucking ass. Like, get off my dick. Jeez Louise. We're pretty close, though. But no, I, I genuinely like the story of this game. I mean, there's some interesting things that happen here and there, but overall... I think it's a... I, I, I think this is a really good game. And I recommend all of you to try it. I do. Who is that? Is she hurt? Yeah. You're looking at the bad guy's sister. Bad guy? The one who caused all this? That's right. Her asshole brother caused the zombie outbreak. Yeah, I feel bad for Isabella. His sister? What in the hell is going on here? I mean, does this have anything to do with that announcement earlier? I don't know much more than you at this point, okay? But he shot her, I can tell you that. And just so you know, that would be the same guy that shot you. What's he after? What's his ultimate goal? I don't know. But according to her, his plan isn't over. Not yet. Fine. Consider her in DHS custody. We'll question her when she wakes up. <laughs> no.
No, I, I feel bad for Isabella, though. I, I don't think she deserved to get shot. All right, case six is on September 21st from 3 a.m. The next case will occur at 3 a.m. That's fine. Santa Cabeza. It takes place here. Um... There's something I want to try. There's something I want to do, actually. So, while we wait for that, I don't know if I can do it, but if I can, this will be uh, a little fun. It's a nice little psychopath battle. And it takes place in the movie theater. With the fact all those cloaked guys showed up, and they were considered as psychopaths, I'm guessing he might be there still. Wow. Wow. An apple heals like two to four slots, and cabbage heals one? It's a vegetable guy! Oh. oh dear. I mean, I get it, it doesn't contain much to it, but... It's still healthy. Ah! Kendall Johnson, what the fuck? This is kind of weird, but there's a group of freaks in raincoats- Ah, yep. They're wearing matching masks, too. They're really giving me the creeps. So, I find it funny. That's exactly what I was about to do. <laughs> I, I don't know why it's so funny. Ah, no! Baba Booey. It, it's really funny, though. That's exactly the, the mission that I was going for. I didn't know they were going to list it, though. Oh, uh, my sword's about to break. I'm just going to use it on a few more zombies. I'm probably going to drop it, actually. Yeah. Okay. That makes me curious. Why does orange juice... And coffee. Oh, I just really lost a life from that. I normally don't lose a life from doing that. That's sad. It's really sad. Ooh, we got less than three hours for the Santa Cabeza mission. Can I do this in time? You're damn fucking right I can do this in time. Watch me. I'm gonna fucking do this, man. <laughs> I'm gonna save, though, because if I happen to die in the psychopath battle, I don't want to have to go from where I last saved just to get back to this point. And if I happen to fail the important mission of Santa Cabeza from taking too much time, I don't want to fuck up neither. So, like, if I go into this battle and fucking... Oh, wait. I can find a... Uh, Something here. Chips. There we go. Fully healed. Now let's go fucking fight some mask cloaked psychopathic motherfucker. Oh! They're waiting, waiting. Bro, what? Get off of me! Bro! No. No. That's what I wanted to avoid. I forgot they can do that if you get to- Son of a bitch, man. Son of a bitch, come on. Like I said, thank God I saved at that bathroom. Not even kidding. Thank God. Unbelievable. I need to be more careful, because they're all, like, blocking the path. Back up! Fuck you! Oh, you stabbed me, you bitch. Come on! Oh, throw. Wow! That hurt. I'm gonna go eat them chips now. <laughs> I took care of them. That's what I wanted to do. 
I wanted to get them out of the way. So let's go eat these. Oh wait, I can combine chips. You can combine. No way. You can combine chips. What does that make? Spitfire. You know, I go for the Spitfire and I pick up a cabbage register. <laughs> cabbage. Is there another thing of cabbage in this box here? What the fuck? It's a Mega Buster. That's like a weakish weapon kind of thing. I don't know. I need a fuck. Oh, I was just over here. Why am I coming over here again? Um. Oh, change clothes. What can I put on? Oh, fuck yeah. That's sick. So we got a furry mask guy here. <laughs> oh, dear. Mega Buster. No, what? Let's go. Take a fucking Mega Buster. Let's do that. Okay. Whatever happens, happens. Here. Those who reject salvation embrace ignorance. What the fuck? This guy's gonna force his religion on me! Now I... shall return your tainted blood to the foul earth that has spawned you! Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Hello, Sean. How are you? I'm better than you with the sword. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Howie. Ah! This bitch! This bitch! Yo! He does not give me a break. Oh, that's a good... Boom! Ow! Okay, he's a little better than me with the sword. He's a little better. Oh! Uh... Yo, can you fucking quit, you fucking bitch? Oh my god. He's such an asshole, bro. Fuck you, asshole. Achievement unlocked, peacekeeper. Wow! I bet he really regrets having that there. <laughs> ah! No! 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 Oh my god. Boom! Baba Booey! Oh no.
Nope. All right, well. What do I do? I untie you guys, or? Oh, I, I go here. Okay. Who knows who these freaks are? Come on. Are you all right? I got you, Ray. I'll get you back. You're an NPC. Oh, I don't think you can do that much. What happened? Yeah. <laughs> Let me get you. Are you all right? What the fuck? Thank you. Of course. Anytime, my dear. You can't uh, guy literally got caught up in zombies. What the fuck? My sword is okay. I just wasted a beverage. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Boom! <laughs> this weapon's fun to use, but it's so dumb. I don't think I can save these guys. I don't have a good weapon. I don't think I could save all of them. Is it unfortunate? Un unfortunate? Is it unfortunate? Yes, it's unfortunate, but. Whatever happens, happens. It's NPCs. NPCs in this game are... Beyond stupid. Okay? Follow me. Oh, wrong way. Follow me. Holy crap, two actually followed me. It's insane. Ah! Okay. Can I have- Shut up, bitch! Cash register! The cash register didn't do shit! Oh, dude. This sucks. Holy crap, I'm killing him with these. God damn it, man. Crank! Crank! Dang, shut up, my guy. It's ridiculous. Dude, it's one zombie. Come on. Come on. I don't even care. I don't even care. I see three. Michelle. She's dead. You know what? If they all die, I don't care. I have stuff to do. Come on. Come on. Come on. Follow me. Follow me. Come on. I'm gonna use a guitar. I don't have many weapons. Oh, that's sick. Follow me. Michelle's dead. And they're all back there. Well, they're dead. Oh, well, just gotta move on. Rest in peace, you poor innocent souls. I am not putting myself through hell to save NPCs that pissed me off. Yep. Oh, well. Go fuck yourself. Maybe if you would have stuck with me, you fucking NPC, you would have been fine. But no, you know. NPCs are one of the stupidest things you can come across in this game. Literally, the zombies are more intelligent than NPCs. It's disappointing.
So I'm honestly at the point where I don't give a shit. Owie. Yep, I know. I ah! Owie. Okay. Yeah, they're they're goners. They're we're not saving them. Otis, I'm not answering your call, nor do I plan to. You got a problem? You can suck my ass. Try it, bitch. My inventory is full of garbage. <laughs> Cabbage! Absolutely delicious. Yeah, Ray and Nathan, they're dead. Okay. I'm not saving these NPCs, man. I'm not putting myself through hell for NPCs. Not happening. No, no. Never, ever. What is your name? Isabella. Isabella Keys. Well, Isabella, this is an emergency, so we'll skip the formalities and cut to the chase. Consider this an official interrogation. Tell me everything that you know. Fine. I'll explain why all of this is your fault. There was no drug trade in Santa Cabeza. Just an American research facility. They were doing research on some sort of parasitic insect. Like a wasp. A wasp that turns living things into zombies. The queen. If you don't believe me, just ask the man who was in charge of that research. The head of the Santa Cabeza Livestock Research Facility. Dr. Barnaby! What? Huh? That son of a bitch is evil. Jesse. It started. He's turning. Hey. Shoot him. Truth, Doc. Were you conducting experiments with zombies? Zombies? Stock. 
So the government's now in the zombie making business. The whole story about the drug trade was a cover up? What do you know? We were trying to mass produce cattle. Do you have any idea how much meat Americans consume in a single day? <coughs> that research was absolutely necessary! Kids throwing a temper tantrum be like. So Dr. Barnaby is the cause of all this. Ew. One day in my village. The people turned into zombies. Those damn wasps. They escaped from the lab. It wasn't long before they got to work. Some spread. The army was called in. They killed everyone. So, the terrorism is a retaliation for a cruel government cover-up. Sounds plausible. Or it could be some serious bullshit, in either case. We have to get out of here alive if we want to find out for sure. We have to check if she's been bitten. Let me take a look. I'm a medical technician. I could be useful if you let me do my job. I know I have no right to ask, but please, let me help. If you don't get out of here, the truth dies with you. <clears throat> All right. If allowing you to atone for you and your brother's scheme makes things go more smoothly for us, I'm all for it. Yeah, Isabella's not bad. I, I like Isabella. She's great. But Car like Carlito, like I said, Carlito's just doing this the wrong way, man. Like, he could be doing this in such a better way, but he's not. So, this one is Case 7 1, The Last Resort, starting at 11 a.m. At the Be Here Back at 11. Barnaby is dead. Could Carlito's thirst for revenge be sated now? Um, I'm not sure. Jesse's still a rookie. I should have never brought her into this situation. I take full responsibility. Her injuries aren't serious, but I can't tell if we're looking at a bite wound or not. We'll just have to keep a close eye on her. Oh, another guy died. You gonna be okay? Gonna be good? What about you? 
Jesus Christ. Got people dying left and right. You may have bitten off more than you can chew this time, Frank. I suppose it comes with the territory in your line of work, though. I mean, if nobody's doing anything dangerous, you've got nothing to take pictures and report on, right? Yeah. Now, I don't have anything specific to do right now. Can I get XP for taking a picture of you? I can. Like, barely any. Or whatever those things are called. I want to drop everything. I'm only carrying garbage at this point. So, due to the fact I have nothing to do right now, I figure I might as well look for something to do. What is that? Oh, it's another shower head. I'm gonna pick up this baseball bat. Now I'm gonna go on an adventure. Because I have nothing going on. Like, I have no other missions. I have... Personally, no clue. Another shower... What is up with all these shower heads being... Like, in this area? That's strange. Ah. Uh, 10 PP. Hey, you see that little stutter lag thing right when I hit him? Apparently that's just the game. I thought it was like my graphics or something at first, but apparently not. It's what I saw off of Reddit anyway. If I'm wrong, feel free to correct me down below. The comments are here for a reason. Oh my god. I need more baseballs. Baseballs? I mean, bowling balls. Because bowling balls are the strongest weapon in the game. I'm just gonna eat these pies. Wait, what does Nectar do? Isn't there like an advantage to having these types of beverages? I don't remember. But, um... Right now, I genuinely don't know what- Why do I keep taking fall damage now? But yeah, I, I gotta figure out something to do. I don't want it to be a super boring video of just fucking waiting. Or I have to make a massive cut that's gonna be like, so far away, you know? So I gotta find something to do. And if I can't find anything within a few, then I'll just make a cut. No! No! No fucking way they're back! I've killed y'all twice! Twice! They're over there. Unbelievable. Unfucking believe that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. This shit's rigged. This shit is rigged. I'm not going outside no more. Fuck that. This game is rigged. Now I'm irritated. <laughs> I've killed them twice, man. Why do they keep coming back? God. I've 
frustrates me so much. I thought I had them taken care of. Oh my god. Just rooming and zooming. Ah, rooming and zooming through zombies. Bow. Out of my way. Get out of my way. Holy shit, there's so many zombies. Honestly, I could be XP farming. Let me get that fucking chainsaw up here. Oh, dude. Nice. How many zombies can we kill without this thing breaking? We just reached 1,500 zombies in this playthrough. Can we get a record of 95,000? No, I, I don't know. I'm sure people have killed more in one playthrough of this game. I'm certain of that. I gotta heal. Yeah, my chainsaw is gonna break. Oh, there's a queen. Well, I thought I heard a queen. Now I need a better weapon. Oh. I love the bowling ball. <laughs> no, the bowling ball is super fucking strong on, like, basic enemies. Like, zombies and those, uh, cloaked psychopaths. But when we fought that cop lady, um... It didn't have much of an effect on her. But the bowling ball is by far the most superior weapon in the game. Prove me wrong. I look ridiculous. I look beyond ridiculous. Baseball that. I'll take some baseball bats. Let's go kill with the bat. Swing batter batter. Jesus Christ. Ah, yes. The fun of zombie killing with a bat. Owie. Actually, there is something I can do now that I realize that. Uh, I remember getting that one key after beating Cliff. So maybe I can, um, find that area, unlock it, and enter it. There could be something good in there, though. I don't know. Just gotta make my way through this giant corridor of zombies. Ow. Huh. Oh, hey. Coffee creamer. I'm gonna beat up some zombies with the mannequin. <laughs> Jesus Christ! The mannequin's so strong! But it does not last! Mannequin OP? For Dead Rising standards, it should be. Dear God. 
Oh! Oh yeah, I wanna go this way. This might be dumb. Is that one psychopath still over here? So many zombies here. I wasted my nectar. Go to hell. Oh, my God, it's normal people. Yo. I can't move. Are you kidding me? If I die, I'm going to be very upset. I can't do anything. It won't let me move. Nothing. I want to find a gun, and I want to kill all three of them. I want to murder them. That angers me, dude. Well, it starts at 11 a.m., and it's 3. Ugh. Fucking hell. I'm just... Mm. Well. Thanks, Dead Rising. You're the best. I hope those survivors die in a fucking hole. I mean that, by the way. They literally shot me up. They didn't even stop to say, wait, this guy ain't a zombie. You know, he's not dropping after we shoot him one fucking time like every other fucking zombie in the game has. Let's keep shooting him and then fucking die. Unbelievable. I'm gonna go over there and I'm going to fuck them up now. I promise, I'm, I'm not even playing. I'm going to fuck them up. I'm getting the submachine gun. I'm going to kill the zombies within that area. Open that door and I'm shooting them. I'm going to kill every single one of them. And that is a promise. Oh, that is such a big promise, man. It just pisses me off so much, man. Like, I had over, I had nearly 1,600 zombies killed. Now I'm back under the 1,400. <laughs> I had progress stolen away from me. Now their lives are on the line. Get away from me! I am an angry, angry boy. I had my pride stolen from low-life bitches who don't deserve to live. And I promise you, 
You fucking assholes are dead. You're beyond dead. I'm going... Oh, man. Ooh! It, it just frustrates me, man. And it's fine. It's fine. It just gives me something to work for. And now, I crave violence against survivors. You know what? I miss the NPCs that were stupid and got themselves killed. I don't like hostile NPCs. And they're not psychopaths, neither. Like, dear God. Get off me, you whore! I'm getting that motorcycle. Fucking motorcycle. I am focused and I am locked on a target. Line up! Give me my- I need that pipe so I can kill these guys. Bullet point. Oh, I'm glad you defected. I hate you. I can't kill them guys without a weapon. Or without a throwable or some kind of gun. Shit. I needed that handgun. Alright, so I just gotta find a police officer... Cop, and I gotta fucking... God, what way do I go? What am I doing? Are you kidding me? I literally... There's no way. Literally, all these zombies just appeared out of nowhere. All of them just... Wow, man.
I mean, it's just giving me more zombies to add to my list. One more. All right, let me get off. Can I get off? Anyone there? It's not letting me get off. Okay, it is. Alyssa? Come here, bitch! Yeah, you wanna fucking shoot me? <sighs> fucking think so. No, I'm killing you. I'm killing all of you. Yeah, you wanna duck your head, right? Fuck off. That's why I'm getting pushed closer to there, man. Am I the only one who gets irritated at stupid things in this game? I know the zombies are supposed to kill you, but they were literally pushing me into the dude with the gun. You know what? I'm dead. I hate this game. I'm killing one. At least one. Oh, she's close to dead, too. Oh, she's almost dead. Almost. Get up! Yeah! Stupid. You too, Brett. Go, Brett! I killed one. That's all I care about. I don't need to worry about any others. I killed one. I'm done with those fuckers. Let the rest of them perish for all I care. I spotted the guy with long hair over in one of the women's clothing shops in Wonderland Plaza. Oh, that's a psychopath! Thank you, something to do! Holy crap, that's amazing! Oh no! Okay. So many zombies. Oh, I'm so fucking ready, man. Jesus Christ! an objective you're a whore 
So we're going to Wonderland Plaza. I'm gonna save. Because I finally killed one of those stupid survivors. I had to get two submachine guns though. But it makes me happy that at least one is dead. She honestly deserved it. I hated her with a passion. And death is all she deserved. And will that those two guys die? Absolutely. They will not survive. They will die and I will laugh. I will... Ooh. Ooh yeah, I will... Mm, I will laugh 24-7 at their deaths. All right, well, I'm following the arrow. Oh, it's here? I'd laugh for you too. Uh, who, who, who's there? Stay, stay back. Stay back. Get it, get it closer. I'll, I'll light this place up. I suppose you can Try me. laugh at me too. This guy's a monster. <laughs> He legit just ran out of the building. Are y'all good? I'm gonna keep y'all in there for now. What the fuck is that? He's... RC explosives? Oh! This guy's weird, man! Come here, Paul! Why are you running? Why are you running? Jesus Christ. This guy's kind of a pussy. No. No. no! I knew I was gonna get hit by that. This guy... I tried to get it. man fuck stop running like a little bitch no give me this chainsaw that's gonna hit me Zombie! Unbelievable! He's legit a bitch! Honestly, I'm considering just saying fuck him. He is really obnoxious. He doesn't stop running. He's such a bitch. Fuck that guy, man. Unbelievable.
Everything is okay now. You don't need to be afraid. Yeah, he ran away. Like a little pussy. Okay. You got it. Alright. I give you guys weapons. I'm on it. Come on. I I gotta hold your hand, miss. I'm just gonna get these two to safety. I'll come back and fuck this guy up after. Oh my god. If the other lady dies, I do not care. They're ready. Oh. It's just NPCs are stupid. They more likely always, forever, and will Come be. On. Come on! Come on! <laughs> They're legit bumping into each other. Legit, that's so stupid. And I gotta, it's like I have to constantly call him, too. Look at this. God. Hopefully we'll be alright, though. Debbie has a weapon. Oh, wow. Come on, puppy! Come on, come on. You stupid woman! Come on, come on, come on. I Follow have me. to spam this Follow button or else they don't listen! Unbelievable! I'm disappointed. At least these two are fairly easy to save. Holy crap, I actually saved two civilians! Go. That makes me a happy man! Makes me really happy, they actually cooperated. Debbie was a little slow from time to time, but... It's nice! Nice to save somebody. <laughs> Woohoo! Escort complete. 100,000 prestige points. That's great. My attack went up. That's good. Um, well, um... I can go fight Paul more. I know he's still gonna be there. Now that I don't have to worry about them... That means the two survivors are out of the way. Now it's just me and the psychopath. What? There's a guy hanging out in the cosmetic shop in Wonderland Plaza. He doesn't look so good. Yikes. Okay. What? There's like no zombies. That's weird. 
That's really weird. Actually, one of the weirdest things I think I've come across. Might as well kill these guys with the queen. Yes. All of you bow down and die. Just like you rightfully deserve. And let me go get some more orange juice and I'll go fuck up Paul and we'll get that sick guy. Alright, let's go. Alright, so it went from me being annoyed at annoying survivors who tried to shoot at me over and over and would fuck up my day to, um... Shit. But things going okay. It's going better than I anticipated. Back to Wonderland Plaza. Oh, Paul, oh, Paul, oh, Paul. Now, where... Is he back in this other area, or...? Yeah, you can hear his music, so. Yep, he's, there he is. Still half health. Oh, Paul. Such a bitch. He's like one hit. Zombie, no! The zombie fucked me up. Yeah! Gotcha, bitch! Stay away from me! Don't come any closer! Stupid fuck! Well, I do believe we can save him. Fantastic. Nice. <laughs> um. Is it not gonna let me? It's not letting me aim it! Oh no! He might actually die, because <laughs> I, I was being stupid. Well, bye, Paul. Bye. He deserved it. Alright, let's go rec rescue this sick man. Oh, Paul. Now, hopefully, if he's sick, I can carry him. Hello, Leroy. Too dangerous to be out here. My apology. Yeah, sorry, man. Oh. Why do I keep rolling? Frank, you can't roll for shit, you fat fuck. You a little you look a little sick, you feeling okay? Sorry. I'm fine, just that. a scratch, no problem. You're hurt? Where? Show me. My apologies. Guy, you gotta talk to me. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Follow me! So I gotta give this guy a weapon from the last. Oh my health thing went up. Alright, let's go save Susan here. Follow me. Jesus Christ, Susan, you okay? Yeah, Susan is surrounded. Oh dear. Stop rolling, Frank! Oh my god. I 
I don't think I can save the sick guy. Oh my god. Yeah, he's dead. I think both of these guys are dead. Stupid fuck! Dude, I gave you a sword and you can't even use it! It was a waste of a weapon! At least I could save her. Get off of me, prick! Come on! Unbelievable! You stupid old woman, I should let you die! Ah, oh, you fat idiot! You see what I mean? The NPCs in this game are the worst! He's a zombie now. Tried to help you, but guess what? You're fucking stupid. It's ridiculous, man. Oh, God! At least I was able to keep myself busy for the last resort. God. She holds my my hand consistently. That's nice. Got to get you out here, though, woman. Why, thank you. You're welcome. At least you're at full health again. Get off! Oh my god. It's always some stupid fuck zombie. Over here. Shut up, Susan! Over here. Over here. Over here. <laughs> I hate this game sometimes. Susan, you are the. You're stupid, Susan, you old fucking idiot. Wow. I should punch you. If I can get you to the rooftop, I'm punching you. I'm kicking the fuck out of you, Susan. Like, goodness gracious, dude. You know, fuck you. Come on. Follow me. I don't even want to hold your hand. Oh my god. Come on. Come on, you stupid old lady. Come on. You deserve that. Boy, thank you. I didn't want to give her a drink. <laughs> Go. 
god. She's 76 years old. Okay, she she's nice, but she's still annoying. And I'm level 24. Level up. Yeah. New skill mastered. Well, it's getting close to 11. I just gotta wait. So I'll be back when it gets to 11. What is this last resort talk all about? Carlito said that he'd blow up the mall if he were cornered. <laughs> Damn. We've got a regular suicide bomber on our hands. It's than what you're thinking. The explosion would send parasitic larvae into the atmosphere. He plans to spread zombies outside of the city? Is he insane? If that bomb goes off, there'll be nowhere to run. The zombies will be everywhere! He's planning to flood the area underneath the mall with flammable gas, then set it off! If you could take care of the bombs while the gas concentration is still low... There's a chance we could stop the explosion. Let's do it. That's scary! That's really scary. I do want to save because I would like to end the episode. I feel like I've overstayed my welcome. I'm getting sleepy. Anyway, if you like this episode, make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed. Make sure to... I was about to say it again. I don't want to repeat myself over that stupid shit. <laughs> but uh, you can download Dead Rising in the description. It costs a little bit of money on Steam. And that's all I got to say. So thanks for watching. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.